Hey guys, it's Petunia Gal, and we are back over in Planet Zoo, and we are going to start a new career on the Myers Lake Island Zoo. So, let's see. Situated in a sun-drenched corner of Greece, Myers, uh, Greece, <laughs> Myers Lake Island Zoo is Dominic Myers' first foray into the world of zoo building. As such, he's started small and then crammed as much into it as he could. These two elements have combined to make a somewhat subpar zoo, so there's plenty of room for improvement, assuming you can first find the space for it. So, this sounds kind of interesting, so let's get into it. Um, but let me know what you guys think about how many parts these should be, um, if I should work um, in between to try to make them, you know, like four parts. Or if uh, you guys don't mind them being a little bit longer and maybe doing more creative things with it. Um, I don't know. Let me know what you guys think as far as that goes. That is pretty. Hey there. You'd better sit down for this. Uh-oh. I've got some news. A week ago, Bernie went missing in the Arctic. <laughs> I know. I only just found out. Apparently, our illustrious board mm. of governors decided it was best not to tell anyone while the search parties were still out looking for him. But a few days ago, they called off the search. And they oh, hadn't no. found him. So, they had him declared legally dead. Just so they could sell off all of Bernie's zoos. Everything, from the aardvarks to the zebras. They no. didn't even wait for Bernie's daughter, Emma, to get back from overseas before they cashed in. They offloaded the whole company to a slimy hedge fund manager called Dominic Myers. Mark my words. He only wants the zoos to help buff out his tarnished image. Anyway, I guess he's your new boss now. Not mine, though. He fired me. Good luck. No. I know you'll do your best. I know you'll protect the animals. <clears throat> well, that's sad. All right. So... <clears throat> this is a pretty, uh, pretty zoo. Ah, there you are. First, let me say how sorry I am that we're meeting in such awful circumstances. I was a great admirer of... Benjamin. Wait, no, Bernard, Bernard. You may not know this, but we were actually very good friends. That's why it's going to be such an honor to continue his life's work of letting people pay me to see animals. I can see you're still sad, though. Perhaps this will lift your spirits. I'm making you senior zoo manager. It's a position of great responsibility, although these same wages. I've also bought a new zoo, which you're going to be in charge of. It's a bit of a fixer-upper, but it's nothing you can't handle. All you have to do mm -hmm. is make the animals happy, get those annoying protesters to leave, expand the zoo of Scosh, adopt a grizzly bear and a Siberian tiger, make sure the zoo is extremely profitable, and then just pass a teeny tiny little inspection. Trust me, you'll have more spare time than you know what to do with. Oh, and uh, also you have to research some bears or something? Oh, I forget the details. <laughs> this guy sounds like a great guy to have in your corner, right? Okay. So I'm going to pause. Let's see. We need at least 1,150 guests in the zoo. Uh, earn a yearly profit of 15000 That one might be tricky. Um, I'm never too good at the yearly profit stuff. And then I have no protesters. So um, that's going to be... Yeah, we have 24 protesters right now. All right, so let's get to it. Let's see what these messages are over here. Can I click? Okay. Um, can't find accessible staff room. Can't find accessible staff room. Okay. Where are these guys at? Uh, doesn't really help me a, a lot. Where is he? Or she? Who is it? Workload high. Okay. So, let's see. Uh, I'm wondering if there's any empty spaces that we can put uh, buildings in. Uh, you know, the staff buildings and stuff. Because sometimes they like to hide small, you know, empty buildings to put stuff in. And we obviously need more staff rooms. So, um, I think we go to, let's go to zoo. Oh, come on. Zoo. There we go. 
And I need a workshop. Of course I do. Yeah, we have to make people happy. I mean, they are not happy right now. So, is there any way to... I know I should know this by now. So, um, facilities, there we go. Uh, let's see. High demand for gulpy soda. Just want to look and see what we have. We have drinks, we have food. Uh, we have two merchandise. It's a lot of toilets. I wonder if we go ahead and do this. And can we change it here? No. I want to make this just a little bit of money. Uh, not a lot. We'll do... Oh, I was like, why is it not working? Uh, we'll do like 15 cents, I think. Just to get a little bit of money in that way. Wait, it doesn't show that it changed. Oops, that's the one I wanted. Why did that not change? Come on. Let's see. It does say 15, but it doesn't show that on the thing. Let's uh, take off synchronize and put it back on. Wait, 90 cents? What? 15 cents. Why does it say 90 cents over here? Oh my goodness. I don't know what's going on there, but okay. So what I'd like to do is, um, obviously, we need to put in another staff room. So there, this zoo is like built up in such a weird way. It's kind of hard to tell like where everything is. And how you get to it. <laughs> Minor technicalities. Alright. And I have never seen anybody play on this zoo. So this is like totally new. Oh, totally new for me. And that is not what I wanted to do. Let's go ahead and go back up. So. The first thing we should probably do. Other than get another staff building in here. Is check out the welfare of the animals. Um, I don't see any empty spots from the stuff I've seen anyways. I know we've got important stuff. I get it. Oh, it has no security guard. Um, I don't know if we should buy it. Hmm. We pay for a security guard yet? I guess we'll get one just so we'll be happy that way. All right. Let, let go. Okay. All right. So let's see. Let's go to um, this one. Oh, this is just an exhibit. I bet. I bet we have to um, research. Or maybe just get rid of some of these. Um, let's just. Let's just do that. I not click on that. Okay. So, if we go to exhibit... Oh, temperature. Okay. Well, we can deal with that. Temperature. Um, we'll make it a little bit hotter. Uh, a little bit hotter than that. Okay. <clears throat> I'm going to pause it as we try to work on some of this stuff. Just get the animals happier. Because, you know... We want happy animals, right? So, actually, I don't think we want it that much. Well, we have to play it for it to move, right? Okay, there we go. Got the temperature. And I'm guessing... Oh, we can. Okay. So, the layout is 100%, so we don't have to worry about that. Awesome. Okay, so we got that taken care of. All right, so let's go look at our animals um, over here. And pause it. Um, let's see. Yeah, all this welfare is like totally nothing. All right, so let's go. I think some of these we just need to sell because like aardvarks, I think just like one. Go away. Um, just like one, uh, one male, one female. 
So let's go ahead and find this one. Well, and enrichment. Um, wonder, do we have to? I don't think we have to have a workshop unless we want to uh, do the mechanic research. So let's go into here. Uh, they have a sprinkler that they don't like. Where's the sprinkler? Okay, the sprinkler is not that hard to find. Where? Oh, there it is. I thought that was just uh, something else. Oh, well. There we go. We'll go ahead and get rid of that one. They don't like it. See, I wish when you clicked on the animal and then you clicked on habitat, it would like automatically um, sort for that animal. That would be awesome. So, aardvark all the way at the top. Awesome. Oh, and we probably, well, I don't know. These, the one of the main things we're probably going to run into is space. Because there's not a lot of space for these guys. So, we're going to have to figure out what to do with that. Let's go ahead, go back over to enrichments. And we'll go ahead, I like to go ahead and dr uh, drop this down into the ground. Uh, I don't know if that was as much as I could have done, but oh well. And so we're good there. All right. And then let's, so that was a food. Let's go ahead and do herb scented marker because they don't like the other thing. All right. Oh, they still want more though. I wonder if it's going to help if we put another one of these. Oh, that's close enough. Uh, I think think or we just gonna have to there we go 98 percent awesome okay and let's look at the terrain they want some hard shelter for now while we're just trying to get all the animals happy let's just do a um already built shelter and put this uh do we want to put I don't think we'll put it all the way in the ground, but do like that. And then let's give them some bedding. Oh, that might be a little too big. Because I've noticed there is, like, if you um, click on these. Um, oh, I'm hitting shift. I was like, what's going on? Uh, if you click on these and, like, during the rain, it will say, like, slightly damp or dry or, you know, whatever. So... I don't know what the effects are on the animals with that, but I want to try to keep it, you know, keep this stuff inside. Where is this? There we go. It's like, I know this is here somewhere. So I want to try to keep it inside, like totally inside of the shelter. So there we go. That's kind of weird that the land did that, but it's okay. So, that should give them enough, I think. Or not. Why did that give them less? <laughs> it seemed like that gave them less. That's weird. Let's go ahead and look at the Zoopedia. Because I'm pretty sure it... Yeah, I'm pretty sure they only like one, one male, one female. Yes. Okay. So, let's go, not the question mark, let's go over to the uh, animals, and let's see which ones, they're all pretty much, the, they're all the same age, actually. So, let's go ahead and get rid of these two. Uh, we'll just do release the wild. Awesome. And so they should be happy. They should be. Uh, they look pretty good. I still say hard shelter. Let's see. What if we... Huh. That is so weird. Okay. Well, let's just get rid of this. I don't know. That is really weird because they're not that big of animals. So I don't know why that shelter wasn't working for them but okay we'll do wow that is humongous <laughs> I don't see why they need that big of a shelter how about let's do this we'll go ahead and do uh, hit Z 
rotate that around like that. And then we'll bring it down a little bit. No. I don't want the ground to start coming in on that. So we'll just go ahead and move these um, here. I don't know if I can get to all of them since I since they're all like down below the the thing. Come on, click. There we go. But this should be enough. I mean, for two aardvarks, this should be plenty. Of course, I thought the other one would be plenty, but apparently I was wrong. Okay. So, let's see. See how that does for you guys. Uh, oh, I thought that was shelter. I was like, see, there we go. All right. Let's go ahead and play. 81. Not, not too bad. I still don't understand how that's not enough shelter, but okay. And the other thing that's good to do is go over here to uh, shelter, habitat, and we can see the tra traversable area to make sure there's no, like, no places they can get out. So we're good there. Awesome. Got those guys taken care of. Um, then we have our Asian elephant, or African elephant. I don't know why I said Asian. I guess because the name, it starts with A-S. I, I don't know. Okay. Oh, wow. This is, this guy is not doing good. Okay. So, let's go over to Habitat. We'll take off that. And let's see. I'm going to go ahead and pause it again. It's a lot of pausing and playing in this. I don't. I don't want to play too much because I know that we've got a lot of issues. Lots of issues. Okay. Let's see. Do we have any enrichment? I know there's an important thing. I get it. Go away. I kind of want to turn that off. That's kind of annoying. Okay. Let's do a mud bath. Um, do one right here. Let's go over to enrichment. I don't like the sprinkler or this, I'm guessing, is the other thing. Yeah, okay. Take that out. I don't even know if any, either of those are elephant things. Oh, yeah, sprinkler is down there. Okay. They've just had them for too long, so they don't like them anymore. Or this, I say they, there's only one. Okay. So we've got... Uh, enrichment and uh, wait oh there's another sprinkler in here let's see I really do like the zoo, the look of the zoo but um, I can tell that there's a lot of small habitats and let's do that nope that okay Let's give them a rubbing pillar. Her a rubbing pillar. I'm going to keep saying them. That's just, it's just what's going to happen. I can see it already. This elephant is not happy. Food enrichment. One of the things is like the food quality. But I don't really want to up that yet. Because that's going to up our price. So, oh, you know, our prices for the animals. So, there we go. That should be good. Environment is okay. Need more short grass. Let's give them more short grass. Okay. And then also some soil. Put soil over here. If it's not already. It looks like it pretty much is, but... we I think we're gonna... Oh, no, we're good. I was gonna say, I think we're gonna have to put some more short grass, which I think I'm going to go ahead and do just because I like it to be kind of, kind of in the bar, you know, not just like on the edge. Okay. So we got that. Uh, let's go ahead. Uh, let's get out of the terrain. I'll click on that. Click, click on that. There we go. And let's do call keeper. All right. And we'll see. I mean, this is a very small space over here. Wait, is there? Yeah, there's water in there, too. All right. 
<clears throat> let's do let's go over to terrain it does say they have enough area which is kind of surprising actually let's go ahead and fill this in with some grass first who likes all that long grass and then a little bit of long grass uh, we'll put it like over here There we go. I don't like all that long grass, but they do, so, okay. The only problem is they want a shelter. <laughs> and this place is already so small. Um, let's see. Can we go to... Oh, we can't. We can't. We can't change the scenery. The uh, terrain, like, actually, you know, push it down or whatever. Uh, that's annoying. I hate that. I hate the ones we can't change the... Uh, I, I'm sad now. <laughs> I am sad now. Okay, so let's go ahead and take this off. And we'll go to that. So what I'll probably end up doing is I'll do a lot of this in between. Um, we're kind of getting close to the end already. Um... Let's see. Am I looking for a common? Because <laughs> there's a lot of stuff to do in this one, um, just to get it get it to where we can actually make the animals happy and the um, the people happy. So let's see how small how small of a thing we can get in here, because this may not be big enough. I mean, it wasn't big enough for the aardvarks. That one's going to be too big. Unless we, like, make it where it's over here by the viewing areas. But then they're probably going to get stressed. So, I don't know. How about... How about if we put it over here? We'll be kind of in, in the way. I don't know. Let's just put it kind of in the middle. There we go. And we'll give them some bedding. This isn't very big. Uh, like, wide. I'm going to have to put the bedding kind of in the middle. I think I pretty much did the same thing for the aardvarks. Alright. And I like to kind of rotate it. I know it's just a round, you know, bedding, but... I still like to rotate it. Okay. There we go. And they probably want some enrichment. So. They don't like the mud bath anymore. They, they don't like. Oh, I gotta get out of this. Okay. There we go. Let's do that. And we'll give them what we can here. So they don't like the mud bath, so we're going to have to put this in. Wait, that's a forager. Let's do that. That is humongous. wonder if they're going to say their, their place is too small after this. Oh, man. Uh, we'll go ahead and click that. Do call keeper. Okay. Let's go ahead and click on that guy. Or girl. I don't know. Um, let's do H so we can check the traversable area. Um, I don't know why this isn't, this doesn't say they can get in it. Hmm, that's weird. Let's go ahead and hit P. Oh, it has to refresh, I think. There we go. Okay. That's why. That is why. Okay. So, we'll get out of that. They still want an enrichment. Toy enrichment. So let's see if they have any. Okay. Let's just do rubbing pillar. I like rubbing pillars. They're cool. I mean, these spaces are just super small. Um, let's see. See, I can't even put those there. The the thing still um that's being requested. The um the things that you put down still kind of interact with the with the ground. But you can't actually, you know, do anything about it. Uh, there's a lot of trash here. 
so I'm going to get away from the animals for a second. We've got three. Let's go ahead and get a couple more caretakers. And I need to do work zones and all that. Um, but what we can do is just go ahead and go into facilities. And I think, I don't think any of these have like donation boxes and everything. So I'm probably going to do that in between as well. Because you guys have seen the donation boxes and the education boards. Um, if you want me to do that in the episode, definitely let me know. Um, I kind of like this. Let's do that one. So we'll just kind of put some trash cans around to get all. I mean, there is so much trash going on around here. So I have a feeling I'm going to be doing a lot of in-between work. Just because, you know, this is going to take a while to get everybody happy again. Everybody and every animal happy again, I should say. And there is a lot of area. Like, this is actually... What is this building? Okay, yeah, there are so many paths and so, so much trash going on. Oh my gosh. So, uh, I think I'm going to end it here. And like I said, we'll be doing a lot of stuff in between. Let me know what you guys would like to see and what you guys don't, you know, what you guys want me to do in between. And, um, I've got lots of animals to make happy. We'll just, I'll just be doing like the basics of, uh, getting, getting these guys happy and, uh, you know, back to actually, actually, uh, being okay with people watching them and all of that. So I'll just be putting bins down and the education boards, all that. There's trash cans here. That's weird that there's not trash cans over there, but okay. But there's lots of animals, lots of things to go through and check, and so I will do that. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed. If you have, definitely hit that thumbs up. Also, if you're new to my channel or haven't already, go and hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to hit the bell to get notified of videos as they come out. And if you um, want to play this game or check out any of my social media or Patreon links, they're all down below in the description. Check those out. Come over and have some fun over there. And if you um, have any questions, comments, tips, anything like that, definitely uh, leave those down below in the comment section. And I will get back with you as, as soon as I can. And um, I think that's all. I There's always something else. But you guys know, just check out all the stuff below. And um, let me know if you want to see more of the um career and you know get more like creative with it and all that oh my gosh this giraffe has hardly any space i think there's a little bit more space in there but yeah so until next time thank you guys so much for watching hope you have a super blessed day and i will see you next time bye guys